It's Tuesday, October 28, 2014. I'm your host, Jack. Welcome to Netlink Daily, your source for tech news Monday through Friday. The WD Red family just got bigger. Now compatible with 16 bay solutions and available in up to 6 terabyte capacities. Click to learn more. Alienware has just announced its Alienware 13 Gaming Notebook. What's so special about this notebook? Oh, not much. Except for it has an optional external graphics card enclosure. The Alienware graphics amplifier, as it's called, connects to the 13 via a proprietary cable that utilizes PCIe and USB. You can take any PCIe GPU from Team Green or Team Red and put it in the enclosure. It can power up to GPUs that have a TDP of up to 375 watts and has four additional USB 3 ports for other accessories. For now, the amplifier only works with the 13 and it costs $300, but hopefully, down the road, we'll see external graphics card for all notebooks of every size, shape, and brand. Hashtag notebook equality. Speaking of notebooks, news of a mechanical keyboard notebook is floating around. A bunch of different sites have mentioned MSI's new GT80 Titan. This gargantuan beast weighs in at 4.5 kilograms with an 18-inch screen. And yes, the GT80 Titan has a backlit mechanical keyboard with brown cherry switches. Not a whole lot of other info is available at the moment, but the GT80 Titan is expected to have some sort of SSD RAID and a pair of GTX 980Ms and SLI. I mean, if all this is true, this notebook is going to be fracking expensive. In Hearthstone news, Blizzard is cracking down on bot accounts. Yep, if you've been using a bot to get gold, you will be banned. Apparently, several thousand accounts have been banned until 2015. Personally, I don't think a two-month ban is adequate punishment, but who knows what Blizzard has in store for repeat offenders. Maybe we'll hear more about this issue when BlizzCon rolls around next week from November 7th to the 8th. What did you guys think of today's stories? Are you all for notebook graphics equality? Is the GT80 Titan going to be worth its unknown price tag? Was Blizzard's two month ban for bot accounts fair? Discuss down in the comments below or on the official threads on the NCX forum. Links will be provided below as well. Shepherd's Pie! Remember, tomorrow is the last day to enter NCIX's Trick or Treat event. Enter to unlock over 400 coupon codes and win your way to over $5,000 in savings and a chance to win an AMD prize pack. Check out the link below for details. All right, that's it for Netlink Daily, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos like this from NCIX.